future projection for stock value on Tesla. Whoa. The projected stock value of Tesla in the next year is between $191 and $312 per share. So this is Rabbit R1, the second batch of delivery that I actually received today that I pay for with my own expense. And I'm really excited to review this as a humble customer point of view rather than an early adapter or top tech YouTubers. Because I don't know whether you have noticed, but these top tech YouTubers, majority of them have been so unreasonable and harsh despite receiving an early prototype not thinking about all the major updates that could come along as well. I mean, I'm an early adapter myself. I tend to receive all these smart home robots in a very early stage before the majority of the customers receive it. And I'm always looking into the positive side on how I could influence, how I could inspire the developers to come up with a better smart home robots. And I think that's what these influencers, top tech YouTubers should have done, but I have actually seen very little of that side and I want to be a positive voice and work together with Rabbit R1 so the rest of the customers who are going to buy this in the future can enjoy this product that could potentially change our lifestyle if you see what I mean so let's get into the unboxing and explore how cool this device is so here it goes keep it open this way so <laughs> it doesn't even come with the charging cable. So as you can see, it's a nice screen and a beautiful orange color that the camera cannot really represent. Got the PTT on the top. We got the rabbit eye scroll reel and also the speaker, USB-C charging and the SIM card slot as well. And also both of the microphone on the top. Pull this one out. Forget about all this. There it goes. So here we have the Rabbit R1. Please peel off the mask with the sticker. Let's actually turn it on. Okay, so the battery ran out. So now it's been charging. Rabbit. Oh, I just love that logo. So, oh, look at that, the camera. Ooh, it just checked you. <laughs> that's very cute. There's a bit of a stall there, but it's not a big deal anyway. And that's really nice feeling. And especially, I really like this case because it can be a stand, but also the charging could be carried out here. Oh, look at that. What's this? It says press it here. All right, so I have to select the network. Oh, look at that, all these instructions. So I'm gonna type in the password. So this is all touch screen function. A lot of people complain that it's not fully touch screen, but come on, this is not a mobile phone. This is the next generation. So I really like this scroll, all right? So go to this thing to activate your account. So once you register online with your profile, it's gonna ask you to scan the QR code. So let's get onto that. Ah, so the link has been successfully made. So it's actually offering you with uh, Spotify or Apple Music, ride share, uh, food and mid journey as well. If you carefully read it on Spotify, it requires a paid account. You need to pay for that. Apple Music requires a paid account. So you need to pay for that as well. Uber, Google login is not supported. That's a huge shame actually, but I'm sure it's gonna come along with updates. And also this requires a paid account as well. So if you press continue, create a passcode. So I could create a passcode. So just scrolling that. Double click for the camera, press and hold to talk. So checking the update as well. So if you look at the latest update email, it says full transparency, we are swamped. So it's Yelp, update and search improvements, Vision UI updates, Wolfram Alpha, also the OTA screen update and translator. So you could translate effortlessly between 100 languages so that's very cool indeed and these tiny bug fix which is the battery five times of efficiency improved wi-fi geolocation error handling keyboard and uber as well right so it's all been updated and it didn't take that long so i'm really happy with this so far so let's try some gimmicks shall we so the best rated french restaurant in central london I just like the way how Rabbit responds when you press that button. Searching for best rated French restaurant in central London. Nice. Wow. That's very cool. Okay. 
So let's try the cheapest Indian restaurant in central London. What's the address for Govinda London in central London? Finding address for Govinda, London in central London. Look at that. London is located at Soho Street, London. How cool is that? So the, does the mapping work? Let's try it out. Give me the direction of Govinda Indian restaurant in central London. Okay, so it doesn't provide mapping, so that's quite interesting. I hope that will be quite a cool thing to have. Maybe team up with Google. So let's try the Yelp. So the search word is search Yelp for. Okay, so press that in. Search Yelp for the nearest news agency around me. The Yelp Rabbit is not available in your region. Sorry for the inconvenience. Ah, so I think that's a typical America first because I'm pretty sure Americans you could use this right now, uh, but British or any other countries, you've got to wait for the uh, region to be available. So that's a bit of a unfortunate circumstance. So there's been a search improvement. So let's try some recipes. So recipe for best vindaloo. Ben is a delicious vindaloo. You can follow this recipe. Ingredients. That's very cool, isn't it? Instruction as well. Wow. Enjoy your homemade vindaloo. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, so there's been an update on the Vision UI. So let's try to take some photo and ask whether it can detect this human scale model, 1 to 100. So here it goes. What is this? Wow! Whoa! Okay, though that was very cool. So that's the actual 1 to 100 scaled a model of a human figurine in red. All right, so let's try this new Gundam that has been added as a decoration for my desk. What's this? There was a bit of a voice change there. Wow, that's really good. That's really, really impressive. I just love this. All right, so let's try for the third time to see whether Rabbit R1 will be able to detect this one. What's this? Let me see. This appears to be a calendar display device or digital calendar. It shows multiple transparent display panels with information such as the date, time, YouTube subscriber count, and view count. The device seems to be designed to display this type of digital information in an organized and visually appealing way. Wow. This appears to be a YouTube themed digital clock or display. It shows the date, time, and various YouTube related statistics or metrics such as view count. The design and styling of the device suggests it is likely used to display YouTube related information in an eye catching and artistic way. Right, so the next one is the Wolfram Alpha update. So you can actually get accurate answers in math, science, tech, society, and culture. So let's try that out, shall we? So here it goes. What's 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 times 20? Working on it, the result of the calculation is 110. This information is computed using Wolfram Alpha. Okay. What sort of chemical elements that needs to be mixed to be able to create a water? To create water, you need two hydrogen atoms and one oxygen atom. That's pretty cool, isn't it? So the Wolfram is very useful indeed. So the next one is OTA screen update. I do not know how the previous OTA screen was, but this seems to be quite simple, minimalistic and straight on the job. So I'm happy with that. Translate from Korean to English which is my mother's tongue, by the way. Getting ready to 
translate for you. That's very cool. Look at that. So let's try Korean. 배고파요. I just said I'm hungry. I'm hungry. Very good. Let's do vice versa. I'm hungry. So you don't need to tell which language you're speaking. That's very good. Let's do a rather long sentence. Okay, so. 안녕하세요. LJP Tech 채널을 운영하는 사람입니다. 구독과 신청 많이 해주세요. I just said, I'm LJP Tech. Please subscribe. Hello, I am the person running the LJP Tech channel. Please subscribe and apply a lot. Well, I just said a lot of view, but that's pretty good actually. All right, so let's translate Bangla, which says I am really hungry, to English. Okay, so press the button. I am very hungry. That's very good. Tomorrow's weather in central London. Checking tomorrow's weather in central London. Whoa, look at the that. The weather in central London on Tuesday is mostly sunny with 84 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay. 0% precipitation. Latest stock value for Louis Vuitton. Checking latest stock value for Louis Vuitton. Okay. The current stock value Whoa. of Louis Vuitton. Whoa, I love that. Is 5.36 USD. Future projection for stock value on Tesla. Researching future stock projection for Tesla. Whoa. The projected stock value of Tesla in the next year is between $191 and $312 per share. That's really good. I just love that. Is there a God? The existence of a higher power or deity is a deeply philosophical and personal question. Is Jesus God? Beliefs about the existence of God vary among individuals and cultures. The belief that Jesus is God is a central tenet of Christianity for many Christians. This belief is based on the doctrine of the Trinity, which holds that God exists as three persons in one essence, the Father, the Son, Jesus, and the Holy Spirit. Provide me with biblical verse that provides information on theophany. One biblical verse that relates to theophany is Exodus 3, 2, 6, where God appears to Moses in the burning bush. This event is considered That's to be really impressive. So to be able to change the brightness, you need to hold and go up and down. Okay? Sound similar thing as well. You just need to hold up and down. So sound effects as well. You can decide to have it or not. Uh, go back to settings. We got Bluetooth, so you'll be able to turn on the Bluetooth network. We've gone through that time. Security power off. Enable terminal. That's good. About uh, compliance and disclaimer. So just like I predicted, after the first major update, this Rabbit R1 has suddenly become a very useful AI companion that you could carry with you in your pocket with a really good. Uh, protective cover that actually makes it stand and charge at the same time as well. So as you have seen from this video, I can actually have a conversation about tomorrow's weather and like nearest location of like certain restaurant or like the value of stock market and the prediction for tomorrow and the future. And also, for example, like me, I had a very decent uh, biblical knowledge discussion as well. Plus, it can translate up to 100 language as I've shown on this video. So contrast to the criticism that I was getting from the uh, top tech YouTubers or early adapter about a month ago, this has suddenly become a very useful device indeed. So that's why with such a device, you have to be very patient with updates and trying to grow with it, trying to interact with the developers and so on. And that's why I have a huge grudge against these top tech YouTubers who just brush away just to surface scratch and then move on to the next device. That's not how you should do tech reviews. You've got to be patient with these devices. And I'm really happy that I bought my own Rabbit R1 and I'm going to flourish it with the experience I'm going to have with this very intelligent AI device that is very affordable indeed. So I hope this video made a lot of sense on how this Rabbit R1 does to you. But if you have any queries or you want any feedbacks, please do comment below. And thank you very much for watching this video. This is LJP Tech. All the best. Bye-bye.